will cause some disruptions to those who commute in and around downtown, especially around the courthouse through those road closures in place. Some Port Authority buses are going to be detoured. Also, the family of Antoine Rose II is asking that there be no protests during the trial to cause disruptions. KDK's Lisa Washington explains how some groups found another way to show support. Good morning. Antoine Rose's mother has been very clear that she does not want people to protest during the trial for Officer Michael Rosfeld. On Monday, more than 120 organizations and businesses signed on to an open letter demanding justice for Antoine Rose II. I want to read part of that letter to you. It says, we believe that in order for justice to prevail, Michael Rosfeld must be prosecuted to the fullest extent of the law for the murder of Antoine Rose II. It goes on to note the outcome of this trial can either deepen the division or show that we are truly stronger together. You may remember in the days following that June 2018 shooting up Antoine Rose, there were a number of protests and marches on the streets of Pittsburgh and in Allegheny County. Both Point Park University and the University of Pittsburgh are warning their students of the possibility of protests. Point Park sent an email to their students. Pitts Provost sent a message saying that they will continue to keep the university community informed via social media channels and they will send notification alerts if there are any urgent matters. But again, Antoine Rose's mother asking that there not be any protests while this trial is ongoing. More than 120 organizations signing on this open letter to support the trial. We're reporting this morning. I'm Lisa Washington, KDKA News.